gentlemen, today we're teaching you how to attract girls without saying anything. Because it's entirely possible to make a woman melt for you without even talking to her. And these six and a half tricks will help you be one of the most sought after men in any room. And you won't even have to try. So sit back, relax, and stay out of those comments until we're finished. Because it's time for you to learn how to attract girls without saying anything. Let's go. Number six, get to work. We've said it before, and we hate having to say it, but society dictates what's attractive and what isn't. And if you're someone who, according to most people, isn't traditionally attractive, you're facing an uphill battle that nobody should have to endure. But there are two ways you can deal with it. You can get angry and blame the world for your lack of love life, or you can get to work and become a man that women find attractive. But I shouldn't have to change to get girls. They should like me for who I am. Wrong! If you can't put in the work to improve yourself, how are you going to put in the work to build a relationship? Women worth dating don't want a guy who will mold himself to whatever she says she's looking for. Take it from me, what women really want is a man who knows who he is and has put in the hard work to get there. So if you're not as attractive as you'd like to be, get to work and become more attractive. You can spend an entire year complaining about how you can't get a date. And guess what? nothing will change. Or you can spend the same amount of time busting your ass and end up with real, lasting results that will drastically improve how good you look and feel. Don't like how your face looks? Grow a beard and get some glasses, even if you have 20-20 vision. Hate your job and want a more fulfilling career? Start throwing that resume out there. Overweight? Eat healthier and exercise. Skinny as a twig? eat healthier and exercise. Get a haircut and try a new look just for the hell of it. It'll grow back. You'll try diets you won't stick with. You'll cycle through countless workout regimens and you'll feel like you're failing over and over again. But the truth is, you'll be experimenting with all sorts of habits women love. And if you keep trying to make positive changes in your life, the results of your hard work, how much better you look and how confident you've become will be undeniable. And without having to say a word, women will recognize it the moment you walk into a room. 5.5. Learn the signs. Hey guys, Beardy here, with another way to attract girls without saying anything. Learn sign language. Number 5. Detail. Alright, it's time to get serious. You know what women absolutely hate? A scraggly, crow magnum looking guy who clearly doesn't know how to clean himself up. You can have a beard, but it doesn't mean it needs to take over your face. You have to detail it, fellas. So angle those cheekbone areas and literally change your facial structure and stop letting your neck beard destroy a perfectly good beard. Cut it off. These tiny changes will instantly make you look more handsome and you'll attract girls without having to say a word. But one of the most important things you can do for your face is to clean it after you finish shaving. And a good facial cleanser not only cleans your bare skin, but moisturizes it to keep it super silky smooth. By now, you guys know that today's sponsor, Dollar Shave Club, has all the tools you'll need for the perfect shave, shower, and oral care products. But what you may not know is that DSC is now offering an awesome promotion to try their facial cleanser and shave shave starter set for only $5. The starter set comes with an exclusive razor handle, a cassette of four razors, a one ounce tube of Dr. Carver shave butter, and a one ounce tube of their Hawaiian ginger face cleanser. Listen, you don't have to be a genius to know that a carefully crafted beard or a closely shaved face can help you attract women without saying a word. Join the club with one of their starter sets for just $5. After that, the restock box ships regular sized products at regular price. Get this exclusive deal at dollarshaveclub.com slash manintelligence today. And $5 is a heck of a deal to get there. So check out the link in the description or go to dollarshaveclub.com slash manintelligence and make it happen. Number four, have fun with it. I realize I'm a cartoon character and I don't actually exist, but for the sake of this next point, please bear with me. When I dress up all fancy-like and head out on a Saturday night, do you know why I go out? Well, I don't go out hoping to meet the women of my dreams and will fall in love at first sight, date for a year, then move into an apartment together, and after that, get a dog to see if we can handle the responsibility of a child, which we'll discover two years later after we've had said child that taking care of a dog isn't the same as taking care of a miniature human being, but we'll persevere because we're in love and eventually grow old together and die in each other's arms. 
No. I go out to have a good time, and you should too. Because one of the best tricks to get girls to chase you is to be the type of man girls want to chase. And that type of man isn't moving from woman to woman, trying and failing to make a connection with each one of them. He's out on the dance floor, acting ridiculous with his friends. He's playing a hilarious game of would you rather with a bunch of strangers. And most importantly, he's not making it obvious to every girl in the room that he's searching for an excuse to wash his bed sheets tomorrow afternoon. It may seem counterintuitive, but one of the easiest ways to attract girls without saying anything is to barely acknowledge they exist. Women notice a guy who's having fun. They're drawn to men like that. And even if at the end of the night you don't have a girl asking to share your Uber, at least you'll have a good time. Wait, before you say anything in the comments, give me some time to tell you that we still have three more tricks that will teach you how to attract girls without saying anything. They're super important and will help improve your chances of getting a date in more ways than one. So please just sit there quietly and we'll continue to number three. Number three, the informant. Want to really know how to make a girl crazy for you? talk to other girls. Hold on, I know what you're thinking. You already have trouble talking to girls, and now I'm asking you to magically find one who's willing to talk to you. Where are you supposed to find someone like that? Well, you have friends and family members, right? And at least some of them are women, right? Do you get where we're going with this? You can have the best wingman in the world, but an informant from the other side, a wing woman, will help you learn how to attract girls better than your buddy ever could. Here's why. Nearly every single girl in the world has a horror story about a guy who lost his mind when she rejected him. So naturally, and quite unfortunately, girls tend to keep their guard up around new men, especially if they're ambushed by a guy and his trusty wingman. And when a girl is scouting the room, looking for a guy who might be mentally stable enough to start a conversation with, a guy who's already with a girl is going to be her safest choice. So as long as you and your wingwoman make it clear you're just friends, you're attracting more girls than you think without having to say a single word to any of them. The fact that at least one girl feels comfortable enough to be near you is a signal to other women that you're probably not completely nuts. Plus, when it's time for you to make your move on that girl you've been eyeing across the room, your wing woman will help ease the tension for everyone involved and give you pointers and a pep talk afterwards if it doesn't go well. So find yourself an informant from the other side. She'll teach you how to get a girl to like you in no time. Number two, unleash her inner bloodhound. If you could be any animal in the history of the world, real or fake, which would you be? A mischievous Capuchin monkey? A badass lager? A hot ape? How about an alpha wolf who leads his pack? Bad news for two of those. Ligers have a ton of genetic issues, and there's no such thing as one alpha wolf, because wolf packs are actually family-oriented with male and female parents who run the show as a team. Luckily, we can teach you how to be a hot ape and help you learn how to be more attractive using the science of flirting. Just follow that link. And by the way, capuchin monkeys are definitely cooler than African elephants. Thanks, Beardy. By now you're probably wondering what all this talk about animals has to do with learning how to attract girls without saying anything. Well, since you're not starting a conversation with her just yet, it doesn't matter what animal you'd rather be, or what animal the girl you like wants to be. The only thing that matters at this point is what animal you want her to be right now. And that should be a bloodhound. If you're unfamiliar with bloodhounds, these extremely good boys have been bred throughout history as hunting dogs, and are commonly used by search and rescue teams to track the scent of missing persons. Now, I'm not saying you should go missing the moment her eyes meet yours and hope she finds you. I'm saying you should do the exact opposite and get closer. Why? One of the important aspects of that hot ape video we mentioned earlier is proximity, or getting close to a girl you want to flirt with. And when it comes to getting closer, do you know how to make any girl fall in love with you without saying anything? Make sure you smell absolutely amazing. So wash yourself till you're squeaky clean like a mouse and find a signature scent by mixing colognes or essential oils and experiment with them to find the perfect combination of smells to create a completely unique formula that turns you into some wonderfully smelling mythical creature. Once you find it, every girl you pass will channel their inner bloodhound and will be hot on the trail of the animal who needs to be found. Number one, join the circus. Okay, you know what? I'm going to take over here and make this one short and sweet because I know you guys are dying to say something in the comment. 
do your thing, Beardy. What is the number one way to attract girls without saying anything? Join the circus, metaphorically speaking, and master the balancing act of talking and not talking to girls. Because eventually, you're going to have to talk to the girl you like. And like a tightrope walker at the circus, you have to bring balance to everything you do once you make your move. So if you're ready to approach a girl for the first time, don't do all the talking. Learn to listen. Balance, grasshopper. Been chasing a girl for a long time? Stop being the nice guy by responding to her text at the drop of a hat. Instead, get busy with your own things like we recommended you do at the beginning of this video. Balance. Because sometimes the smartest thing you can do to attract girls is to not say anything at all. There you have it. How to attract girls without saying anything. Guys, let us know what you thought in the comments. And while you're here, why not check out these other powerful videos?